Hi guys, good morning. I purposely wake up this early so that I can film this. So technically, I'm having my internship with this company called Greenhouse Ingredients. They specialize in producing food flavorings, food colorings, and emulsifiers. As a food science student, my role is to mainly assist in research and development and also do basic lab testings on their products, which is under the QAQC. So those are my main roles and the rest of my roles, sample preparation, packaging postings, doing sensory evaluation on their bakery products. This is how I usually prepare for the day. So we're required to wear smart casual and this is how I wear. Plain hoodie and a pair of jeans. Alright, so before I continue, this video is going to be filled with many different clips as all these clips are combined together and filmed at different days and time. So if you want to know what I do for my internship, keep on watching. And I'm all set and we're good to go. So yeah, I need these. This one is chocolate brown. And this one here is the egg yellow color. So the ones that you saw are from my colleagues and the one I got here is called Hot Get My Latte It's Tuesday and it's this day so why not?
And for now, I'm just going to do some testing on products like these. These are the retention samples. And to test SG, we're going to use this SG reader meter. I'm just going to like suck this up. And then once you've done it, you just press OK. We just need to wait until the blinking ends and the alarm will sound off. So there's the alarm and this is the reading. So that's it. So this is the mini device that I'm using to test for RI. So once you pull the product and press start, so the reading comes up and voila, you're done. So I will write all the results and the readings that I've got from the ISG testing right here and then I will do checking to see whether it falls under the range to ensure that the quality is there. If all the readings are not according to the standards, they have to you know, renew the products or they have to like, you know, check on it again. So I am back home. Okay, so before I go to work out, I have a few words to say. So throughout this internship, I've seen a lot of things. I've learned a lot of things as well. The simplest ones like responsibilities, being more organized and how to manage my work. And I also get to do a lot of hands-on on the R&D stuff. I just want to thank Greenhouse Ingredients for allowing me to have this opportunity to join them for this internship. And I'm really glad that I met a lot of new people and made many good friends along the way. It's a pretty good experience, I would say, and I'm really happy with that. So as a food science student, an internship is for you to explore more. So I would suggest if you really want to get a career in food science, having an internship in a food industry is really beneficial because whatever you learn during your university times and as compared to whatever you're doing in the industry, I can say it's like pretty much different because it actually allows you to get more exposure on how a food industry works, how the system there works and how it's everything being produced, being processed. You get to get a bit insight on how everything works. So I think that's it for me and if you want to see more on what I do and what happened during my internship, you can just drop by to my Instagram. If you guys have followed me along the way, you can see I usually post a lot of stories regarding to what I'm doing during my internship. I also saved all of the stories inside my highlights. Yeah, have a look. So I hope you guys like this vlog. Give a thumbs up as well. And also if you guys have anything to ask about my internship, about something that has to do with food science, about what to expect and everything, you can drop your comments down below the comment section and I will try my best to reply all of them. Okay, so I shall see you guys in my next video soon. Bye!